Hi all, hope you've had a blessed day today. Today I'd like to talk about Mark chapter 6 verses 30 through 32. The apostles gathered around Jesus and reported to him all they had done and taught. Then, because so many people were coming and going that they did not even have a chance to eat, he said to them, Come with me by yourselves to a quiet place and get some rest. So they went away by themselves in a boat to a solitary place. Today's world has made us believe that the busier we are, the more respected we become. How busy you are in today's world is a clear indicator of our eagerness to do good and get ahead. But while we're busy making a living, we sometimes forget to live. Many Christians have adopted this mindset into their work for God. We know time is short and we want to do good works for God. We want to accomplish the most for him. Therefore, we take it upon ourselves to be busy because we want to be good stewards of our time and our talents. We become tempted into thinking that God will reward our busyness for him. Only to discover that we've lost our connection with God. We become so busy glorifying how busy we are that we miss those moments in life that really matter. Being busy is the enemy of any love relationship. Especially our relationship with God. Love demands the attention of a restful person, which is why God constantly calls on us to stand still, to pause, to sit, to rest. Sit back and watch what he'll do for his people. God encourages his children to slow down, rest. He knows that when our minds get occupied on a dozen activities at one time, we tend to lose sight of him. Jesus, who we should be mirroring, mirroring our lives after, even Jesus took time in his own ministry to rest. And as he told the apostles here, come, let's go somewhere quiet and rest. Rather than adding more things to your already probably overcrowded calendar, let's reduce that calendar and make more room for quiet time with our Lord and Savior. God bless you all.